Yeah. Um, okay. Hi, everybody. Welcome to The Daily Blue. I'm Corinne Carroll, and today I am here with the founder of the Long Beach International Film Festival, the charismatic Ingrid Dodd. <laughs> and, of course, we're here with the county executive. That's the county executive, Ed Mangano. We're so proud to be here today, and I'm so proud to be here with you two phenomenal people. Oh, thank you. What made you start the, the festival, the, the film festival? Um, actually, it was a dream that I had. Um, I met the county executive on a fan tour that was um, put together by the Nassau County Film Commission. And we met at Gold Coast Studios. And that's where I met my co-founder, Craig Weintraub. Mm -hmm. And um, Quicksilver was going on at the time. And they had a 250,000 square foot climate controlled tent. Wow. And they said, how awesome would that be? Hardwood floors, sound systems to just move in there before they put the merchandise in. And then when they left, we'd be done. So Quicksilver never came back. And I was extremely disappointed. And I spoke to Ed about supporting this idea. And he was on board completely and really made this dream come true. Wow. And not only is it a dream for me, but now it's it's a community event. Oh, for hundreds of people. Yeah. I mean, I think that you make some dreams come true. Yeah. I, I think that pr pretty much a lot of people know that about you. Um, what do you feel about, especially, this year? Well, we're, I mean, it's a little special. Clearly, we're thrilled to support Ingrid and the, and the film festival. It's an important uh, event here in the county. It highlights our commitment to building the film industry, which is a thriving industry now in Nassau County. In fact, we do more filming than four of the five boroughs combined. Mm -hmm. But this year, it's a very special year. You know, the film festival obviously started uh, a year or two before uh, Hurricane Sandy hit us, but now this is the summer after Hurricane Sandy. Right. So it really makes a statement. It makes a statement that we're back here in Long Beach, we're back here in Nassau County, we're continuing to do the great things that we've done before Hurricane Sandy, and this is going to provide an opportunity to bring residents and also tourists right here in Long Beach, help revitalize the economy, but most importantly, put a focus on the film industry, the great talent that we have here, the filmmakers, as well as the beautiful scenery and uh, tourism that we have in wonderful Long Beach. Why did you select Long Beach? I mean, even, uh, I love Long Beach. My husband grew up here. My family, you know, has very strong roots here, and it's just a great place to raise a family. Uh, it's such a philanthropic community. I mean, you break your toe, there's a fundraiser. I mean, <laughs> you know, and yeah. just, they just come together. And especially this year, uh, last year we had the honor of um, uh, giving our honorary achievement award to Scott Franklin, who we all know is, you know, an amazing Hollywood producer. He filmed Noah here, um, Black Swan, the wrestler. This year, when we decided um, to give it to another celebrity, we said, you know, let's wait a second. Let's give it to the community and all these charities that right. came together right. and really busted their butts to just get this place back in order. And they're still doing it. Yeah, but it looks beautiful. Yeah, and so we are hoping that to give the award to the community in general and have all these people up on the stage and then showcase that award in a movie theater someday when we get it back here in Long Beach. Right. Well, you guys stand for what Long Island is, and I'm proud to be united with you for this project. August 22nd at 7 p.m. is the launch. Yes, right. Red carpet on the boardwalk. Red carpet on the boardwalk.